Easy guys, Dom here from Cringy Dad Gaming. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can optimize Grim Dawn on PC. When I first played this game, I did find that my system was really struggling to run it, and I was running it about 10 to 20 frames per second, which was pretty painful. So the first thing I did was played around with some of the video settings within the game, and I got to a point where I actually got a nice balance between decent frame rate and decent quality graphics. The fact that I'm actually recording this on the inbuilt DVR within Windows also means that currently I am running at a slightly lower frame rate because of that, so I am usually getting over 60 frames per second. Make sure that you've got the camera shake off first, but then click on video. We're running full screen for this, so make sure the screen resolution and refresh rate actually reflects that of your monitor. Anti-aliasing off, anisotropic filtering at times 4, we do find that makes bushes and grass look a little bit better. Textures and shadows and shaders at medium, reflections at high, lighting at high, weather at low. Vertical sync on, triple buffering off, detail objects and alpha to coverage on, post processing and depth of field off, and soft particles on with ambient occlusion off. I found this was the best mix for me to be able to get you know, that mixture between a decent frame rate and decent quality graphics. You can play around with it a little bit more if you want to get it to your specifications. But what I found also is there's a few other tips that you can actually do within your PC that will actually make the game run a bit better. We're going to look at that now. Another thing you can do is download CPU-Z. This will allow you to see how many threads that your system's running and amongst other things it will show you things like the speed of your system and that will really help uh, get an idea of how the actual game is running. Once you've got that information about how many threads that your system is running you can then go into your file explorer, go into documents and look for a folder called My Games. In there find Grim Dawn and then go into settings and then into options. At the very bottom of this text log you'll notice there is one here that says max resource threads. This is usually a default on one. I actually changed that to eight because that is how many max threads I've got is eight. Also just make sure that force single processor mode is set to false so it's not forcing a single processor especially if you've got more than one. So another thing you can do is actually go to your game bar settings. If you go to your game bar here and look at this section here that says graphics settings, in here it gives you the option to be able to load a game in and change how the system of that game is running. So if you search and find Grim Dawn, which I've already found, and double click on it, click on options, usually it would be at system default. What you can do is actually click high performance for that and then save that and that will actually help the game run at high performance. So if you guys have taken any tips from this video at all, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And if you've got any questions, please do add that to the comments and I'll catch you guys on another video. Thanks for watching. You're ready for this. Yo, who's the daddy?